Now you may go home. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Thank you, Joseph. You've been wearing black. Beautiful. But you're late, Your Majesty. A queen is never late. Everyone else is simply early. Of course. Her Majesty, Clarice Rinaldi. <clears throat> In less than a month, you will no longer be queen, and I will no longer be your head of security. I think it's time we bring our friendship out of the shadows. Oh, Joseph, I... Yes, yes, my dear. I would kneel if it weren't for my knee replacement. Oh, oh Joseph, then... Perhaps it's time to consider the duty you have to yourself. Clarice, my darling, please think about it. Please. I will. Have you been thinking about us? Yes, I have. I see. If you'll excuse me. No, Joseph. You had to know what I was going to say. I, Mia needs me now more than ever before, and it's the monarchy. I mean, as queen, it's my responsibility. You know how it is. You were never just my queen, Clarice. You were the someone that I wanted to spend the rest of my life with. But if you prefer that I see you first and foremost as my queen, I shall oblige. No, Joseph. Your Majesty. No. I can't do this. I know. <sighs> Darling, listen to me. Uh, I made my choice. Duty to my country over love. That's what I've always done, it seems. It was drummed into me my whole life. Now I've lost the only man I ever really loved. Anyone got a 20 on Joseph? I'm with the Eagle and Sparrow. Joseph. Your Majesty. Dear Joseph, am I too late to ask you to accept my hand in marriage? <clears throat> well, I thought you'd never ask. Shades, you're in charge now. Good luck with Lionel. I'm going to a wedding. Open up, I say, the door is shut! I know it was short notice, but you were all dressed. <laughs> my Lord Archbishop, I would like to take this man as my husband, if you please. Finally. We have come together for a different... With this ring, I thee finally wed. I pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss the bride. <laughs>